Internet of Things is really adding, I guess, two components to computers as we understand them today. One is sensors, the ability for the computer to understand the world by itself. The other is networking. All those sensors can be distributed all over the place. They can be gathering different kinds of information in different locations. It all streams to the computer, which suddenly understands the world. You know, Internet of Things is a, a term that I coined in 1999. And for a few years, I talked about it a lot. And the result of giving that presentation hundreds of times was uh, I went to work at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT. The future is absolutely predictable and completely unbelievable. It's as, it's as easy to predict the future as it is hard to believe it. Here are three things about the future you probably won't believe. 15 years from now, very few new cars will have steering wheels. About five years from now, lots of computer devices won't have batteries. Your children and grandchildren are going to have three-digit life expectancies. It's very common to hear people be very negative about the future. Oh, the world is ending. And the, the, the world has been ending throughout human civilization. The world is always ending. Pessimism is a really cheap, easy, frankly, intellectually lazy way to sound clever. Yeah, the reason to be optimistic is because of future generations. You know, our children and grandchildren are going to do what our, our grandparents and great-grandparents did. They're going, to, they're going to face down the problems they see. They're going to change the world to save the world because it's the world they're going to live in. We face very real problems, as generations before us have. Um, but you know, we will solve it through, through creating. The Internet of Things is a fundamental part of that.